have to see if NC State can just like keep probing this this Duke defense. And there's a. It looks like looks that's like gonna be it. in. Yeah. That's gonna be a score for State. Those you see the Buttes in a way. Um, and what a wow. absolute heave there from he Duke. It. Oh, oh and he wow! Snags it. Just a beautiful. And this could turn out to be good for State. Oh wow! It's a good catch. The just cut in front of the defender. Fell there, and what a beautiful oh, wow. pass in. And that's another score by State. Nonetheless, Duke going to be able to have a chance at tying it up here. Yeah, that could have been. And there oh he goes. Wow. Uh, One, that freeze everybody <laughs> up. Two, but play a could huge very factor. very well factor in. Yeah. But not there. Not there. <laughs> Stayed able to really jump. big, really big momentum and shift if they're able to score here. It looks like they and did. They are able yeah. to. Just like that. Yeah, seriously. Because, I, I mean, I've, you know, dabbled in ultimate every now and then, but. The beautiful diving catch from Henry Poe. It was just really impressive. And he that's slips it, it right upfield, finding sophomore Matt Tucker. And Alpha's just going straight up the line. Senior Bailey Liberto easily finds Connor Chicas, who's low pass to the front pylon. They're able to pass up line and score at last, yes. being forced to reset to Liberto. Berto fires a laser to freshman Dylan Hawkins, and that'll do it for Alpha like this to get the disc on the sideline, but uh, preferably not leave people open downfield. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, that was Trevor Lynch flying yeah. through the air, but just a little too far away to make a play. Right on the end line, but not really finding anything upfield, so they're uh, forced to resort to a backfield throw. And a laser straight ahead. Duke's able to capitalize on their Berto, team. continuing across the field to Chicas. And one thing I kind of noticed was that Chicas well, with a this. beautiful end zone shot to Von Alton. It's just right into his chest. Nothing is defended. Uh, with uh, players running full speed, you know, at each other at opposite in opposite directions and changing direction very quickly, uh, not always able to see all their surroundings. Um, it's very easy to inadvertently injure themselves or someone else. Duke just throwing it away in the backfield. Uh, and then John Bradley on the mark. Now Henry Poe. Junior Josh Smith unleashing a backhand. And it is right on the money for Duke. Looks across the field to James. Just barely gets it. I'm loving these quick short passes. It's really really keeping the defense on their toes. Absolutely, and uh, there's really no better way to wear out defenders than uh, just some classic small ball, uh, forcing them to stay loyal, stay tight. Oh, That's a, like a low backhand, but yep, they're gonna call it. Drew Bunting is able to hold on to it. So NC State able to come away with the win on that possession there. Almost gave up a, a goal, but they were able to, to block it in their half. NC State's going to come away with the win, 13-9. to